Hi everyone, this is Sarah. Today I would like to share my mixed media canvas with you. Now, um, this is a very easy canvas to make. Uh, I didn't use any stamps or any modeling paste or stencils, but only a few uh, supplies. So uh, most things you probably probably have uh, already in your stash. Now, this is it and I love how this came out. I really, really like this style. Um, it was a, a normal canvas, a white canvas, and uh, for <clears throat> the first layer I used uh, some tissue paper, and it's just this tissue paper that you wrap your gifts with, and I just wrinkled it over the canvas and uh, glued it down. I'm gonna put my camera a little bit higher so it's easier to see. So, And then I glued it down with this uh, decoupage uh, mat. Um, glue sealer. So this is a glue and a sealer in uh, one uh, in one uh, product. So I really like to work with this product and it's uh, from Americana. So when I have done that uh, I uh, glued a little piece of paper and this was one uh, that was left from the liver collection. I have one more uh, so if you want to do a tutorial, if you want me to do a tutorial about this canvas, uh, I can. So you see, it was this paper. These were the last two ones from my uh, from my stash. So uh, then I didn't like the color from the tissue paper because the blue was too heavy, uh, too or too bright. So I pulled out my favorite colors from my paint, and that is the Jamaican Sea. So I uh, painted all the sides in the Jamaican Sea, not here. Here I did a little bit of glue, uh, oh, sorry, of paint on my craft mat. I went with it, my finger like this and then I just rubbed it on here and there. Just a little bit so you can see the words still true through that paint. So uh, then I took the seashell pink from folk art and did the same thing with a little bit of paint on my finger I uh, rubbed on the areas that where there was no paint and then I rubbed a little bit on the sides with the seashell pink so, and then um, I put a I had a little little bit of vintage white and I also put it here and there and on the, on the flower to make it a, bit, a little bit more uh, shabby and vintage. When that was done, I, uh, I glued this heart here and I just got it out from cardboard. Uh, I had this flower in my stash and I put a handmade rose on top of it. So, um, next thing I got my um, archival ink in the coffee uh, color. Now uh, usually I love my vintage photo, the stress ink, but because that is not what uh, the ink is not waterproof and I like on my canvases uh, to be everything waterproof, I use this and I think this color is also really nice. So the only thing I did, let me open it, was go over the sides like this and then very lightly touched it here and there uh, on these areas so everywhere there was a crinkle of the uh, tissue paper uh, there was a little bit of inked uh, uh, how do you see it yeah so there is a little bit of ink so and then at least I glued some flat back pearls around here so please let me know what you think. I really, really love this. Um, I really love the colors. I, I love everything about it. I think I'm going to hang it in my living room. <laughs> so uh, just let me think. Uh, let me know what you think. And uh, have a nice weekend. Bye bye. See you soon.